The manufacturers kindly sent a replacement uh, for the chair that uh, was purchased uh, uh, two or three years ago. Uh, one of the main problems on this particular one was that the one of the arms wasn't working properly. So they uh, we told them, and uh, within a few weeks we got a replacement. So now I'm going to just going to check to see how this particular part works. So I've taken off the cover, and you can see there's a rather large spring, and that spring obviously controls the uh, the back part, the reclining part. That works okay. On the other side is not there is no mechanism on the other side um, on that side there is obviously now I'm using um, I would have used the other end of the allen key but that particular allen key is damaged so I thought I'll use the uh, adjustable spanner just to undo it. If you look carefully, the spring part looks perfectly okay. And if I, as you can see, right, if I now turn it over, this part doesn't have the spring, so it relied purely on that one side uh, to for it to uh, lean back. The manufacturer is pretty good. They've replaced quite a few parts. Obviously, it's uh, it's not the best of set, the best of chairs uh, in the world. It's not strong enough to to be used aggressively. Anyway, when I take this off, you'll see there isn't really much to it. It's pretty loose, as you'd expect. Now, also the the parts there um, at the bottom. The thread had gone, and so that was um, needed replacing as well. But there we have it. That's the mechanism. Looks all perfectly okay. That obviously, wasn't the part that had gone. Um, but um, thank you for watching. Please uh, like and subscribe.